Do you know the biggest mistake people make when buying their first airplane? They choose a certified one and end up paying hundreds of thousands of euros more than they should. Today, I'm going to break down the real difference between certified and experimental aircraft. Clearly, honestly, and without myths. By the end of this video, you'll understand why more and more private owners are choosing a completely different path. Imagine you're picking your first or your next airplane, certified or experimental. Most people think certified means real and experimental means home built. But the reality is the exact opposite. Let's start with certified aircraft. These are Cirrus, Cessna, Piper, Diamond, and many others. Every part from the wing spar to the smallest bolt goes through a long and extremely expensive certification process. The structure, materials, loads, engine, propeller, avionics, even the repair procedures, everything must be approved. This system is perfect for flight schools, charter companies, and rental fleets. It's aviation's version of a city bus. Predictable, standardized, highly regulated. Now, what exactly is an experimental aircraft? Here's what most people get wrong. Experimental does not mean homemade. It means freedom. It means modern engineering. It means being able to use the latest materials, avionics, and technologies without waiting decades for certification. There are several types of experimental aircraft. 